all right ladies this is Ayeli from the tree of life tarot and while the other video is uploading and doing its um, magic to appear on uh, life on youtube i'm going to look at those two cars because you can clearly see them they are so similar that you cannot even imagine so similar so we have first let's take a look at is um is Meghan Markle a um, FD, future duchess's karma? Now, let's take a look first about the word karma. The Ace of Swords is a karmic card. It's one of the four karmic cards in the tarot deck. So the Ace of Swords is a karmic card. It's also the card for contracts and soul contracts. So when two souls meet in the planning place of, for the lifetime of a soul, and they decide to help each other grow, or maybe not each other, one of them, is going to say I love you little soul I will do that for you so that you can grow so when two souls decide that they're going to be a life contract a soul contract that means there is no there is no uh, magic in the entire world that can break that contract if you have a contract you will have it and you cannot hide from it you cannot um, not do the contract um, when I get this card for for people who are together but they are not you know let's say they are not loving it uh, that's also a card for divorce, but um, on the soul level, and, and that's the type of reading that we're doing today here. On the soul level, these people have a contract together. And unless the person who, let's say, receives the service is happy, 100% happy, and says, I don't, I don't want anything more, then both of the people will feel that they are connected and they cannot break the bond. This is, again, it's not a bad thing. It will inflict on AFD, sleepless nights, worries, um, open questions of despair like what does she want from me or why does she hate me so much or things like that doesn't matter on a on a higher level this is an agreement that megan will do this for fd and that's it so she will do it and that's something that both souls have agreed on and that's what I want to uh, stress here for the for the other question is um, uh, FD uh, victim of circumstances. There is um, going back here. So the the soul in order to grow, the soul needs to have different uh, obstacles in in its uh, in in their life. They need to have obstacles, experience difficulties. Um, on an energetic level, there's a lot of uh, help for FD yeah? uh, through, the, through the nines. A lot of help. So whatever she asks, she will get it. But on a physical level, on a material level, on a materialized level, there is a lot of troubles, a lot of hurdles. People say people that people like that have a difficult uh, life or difficult fate. They need to overcome a lot of um, um, adversity. Now, is this 
making you a victim of circumstances, it depends. And I'll tell you what it depends on. It depends on the person. In this lifetime, specifically in that lifetime, when she was a prominent female um, in, in her society, in, the, in, the, in, in every lifetime, and I'm talking about this lifetime for LT, but in general, in every lifetime, we choose a role. That role is like a mask. The, the roles that are <clears throat> with the, the lowest um, vibration are the, the roles of um, victimhood, ultimate power, um, immense wealth, um, I said power, what else, uh, also incredible beauty is also very low, um, very low um, vibration. I'll tell you what those roles are. Because the uh, the question was about victimhood, and clearly here uh, for FD, it's easy to say, oh, I'm, I'm such a victim, you know. Um, in that past lifetime, she had ultimate power. What happens is the, uh, the roles with low vibration, when we put them on, they stick to us like a mask, like a, like a sticky dark mask. And if we identify ourselves with that role, what happens is we don't see the world as it really is. We don't see it. We don't see the unseen. We only see through the eyes of the mask, of the role. And that is very dangerous because are you a victim of circumstances? If you choose to be, you will be. And that will be the role of your life. Because in the beginning, you put on a role like you put on, uh, you, you put on clothes. But the roles with a um, low vibration, we, when you put them on, they don't want to come off. They, they, they get stuck to you. They, they get stuck to you in such a way that even if you want to take them off uh, after a while, it will almost feel like you're cutting off from your skin. Um, it's, it's a very, um, very painful, um, painful way to um, take off such a mask. So what, that's, what, what, what I want to say is, for example, if you, um, uh, the, the different side of the coin, okay? For example, if you receive the role of a, a woman with a lot of power, will you identify yourself with that role? Or will you uh, do something with the role basically use the role to do good but don't identify yourself with the role don't say i am that with victimhood do you identify with um with bad um with with difficulties in life again these are difficulties that's how life is if you see it this way Difficulties will come and go. Will keep you busy, so that you don't don't uh, don't so that your your soul grows. And um, for FD, I can see an ambitious soul, a soul that said, "I want to grow." And all of this, the soul contract with uh, Megan, the difficulties in her life, the 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 bad gossip behind her. Um, the uh, the 
let's say the the blows to her self esteem, all of these. They are there to really help the soul to grow. And it's 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 like light and uh, night and day difference. That that big of a difference it is when when you're seeing the view, when you're seeing the world through the eyes of the mask that you can no longer take off or with extreme difficulty, but mostly no longer take off. Or if you see it in, in a completely different way, in, yes, all of this is happening to help me, to help me, to help my soul. All of the difficulties come to teach me to grow. Megan, again, whatever actions she takes in the future towards um, FD, Ultimately, that's for the benefit of her soul. So again, is she a victim of circumstances? No. She has a difficult childhood, difficult life, but it's for the best. It's for the best. She's learning how to manifest better things in life and not in a, not in a conceited, not in an egoistical way, but in, uh, you know, for the betterment of the others, let's put it this way. So, uploading this video and I will deal with uh, the last set of cards uh, in the next video. So, talk to you soon. Bye.